माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास टेन वेलकम बैक इन द प्रैक्टिस पेपर नंबर थ्री दैट इज रिविजन मिक्सडअप क्वेश्चन प्रैक्टिस पेपर फॉर फिजिक्स बिफोर दिस प्रैक्टिस पेपर आई हैव ऑलरेडी अपलोडेड टू प्रैक्टिस पेपर ऑन मिक्सडअप क्वेश्चन दैट इज ऑन रिविजन ऑफ फिजिक्स अप टू टॉट पोजिशन दिस इज द थर्ड प्रैक्टिस पेपर and the first question of this third practice paper is what is the function of commutator in motor what is the function of commutator in motor that is electric motor question number 2 state fleming's left hand rule what is the statement of fleming's left hand rule third question write the characteristics of image formed by a plane mirror we know that the image is formed in case of plane mirror also so what are the characteristics of the image that is formed in a plane mirror you have to write question number 4 which type of mirror is used by dentist dentists use a special type of mirror you have to name that particular type question number 5 What do you mean by resistivity? What is the actual meaning of resistivity? You have to define. Question number six. When can you say that the resistivity of a conductor is equal to the resistance? When can you say that the resistivity of a conductor is equal to its resistance? That is the meaning. Question number seven. Calculate the average distance of sun from the earth very easy and interesting question you have to calculate the distance between sun and the earth what is the distance between sun and the earth that you have to calculate so if you are here to calculate distance means you should know the formula to find out the distance and you must know the formula to find out the distance that is distance is equal to speed into time and speed of light is aware to you that is 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second and the time taken by the sunlight to reach earth from sun is approx 8 minutes that you have to take into account just see distance is to be calculated in question number 7 and the formula to find out the distance is speed into time so if you are having the value of speed of light and you are having the value of time taken by sunlight to reach earth from sun you can easily calculate it out and you know the value for speed of light is 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second and one point that you have to keep in your mind is the time taken the time taken by sunlight to reach from sun to the surface of the earth is approx 8 minutes so you have to take the time taken as 8 minutes and speed as 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second you can easily find out the distance between sun and the earth question number 8 what do you mean by short circuiting define short circuiting or explain short circuiting what does it mean question number 9 how does earthing save us from getting an electric shock earthing saves us from getting an electric shock you have to explain how how does it save us question number 10 differentiate a meter and galvanometer you have to difference you have to point out the difference between the ammeter and the galvanometer question number 11 what is least count what do you mean by the term least count question number 12 calculate the least count of the following ammeter one ammeter has been given to you see the figure very clearly here ammeter is given and you have to find out the list count of this ammeter see here this is 1 this one is 2 this one is 3 and this one is 4 ammeter ammeter is there which is there to find out the value of electric current 
so 1 2 3 4 are in ampere here it is ampere so you have to find out the least count of the following emitter least count means the smallest value that can be measured by an instrument see here in the for the ans uh, answer of question number 11 i am going to explain list count is nothing but the smallest value that can be measured by an instrument the smallest value which is measured by an instrument is called its list count so keeping this point the, def uh, the definition of list count in your mind you have to tell what is the list count of this emitter what is the list count of this instrument what is the list count of this instrument which is emitter the inst name of the instrument is emitter this a is not emitter this a is ampere means the value for electric current is measured by this instrument is in ampere now you have to find what is the least value that can be measured by this emitter that is the least count of the emitter so this is all about of your practice paper number three i hope that all questions seem to be easier and interesting for all of you and you can easily solve all these questions thank you